My name is Cecil Fountain. I'm an MBA student here at USF St. Pete. Everything from the people um, to the work that we were doing, it's interesting because we go as students, but then we're there as people to actually help other people. So it gives you actually a very lot of confidence. It's so different doing a project in, the, in a real world setting rather than just in a theoretical setting. Doing a project with real clients th that can have a tangible difference to somebody, actually making a difference rather than just some uh, paper project. My name is Christine Joyner. I'm a graduate student at the University of South Florida St. Pete MBA program. The most memorable um, was probably hiking up the mountain the last day that I was there and realizing that these people do this every day to get where they're going. Absolutely do it. You will, you will gain a skill set that you could never learn in the classroom alone. Um, would you go again? Absolutely. Um, what one word would describe your experience? It was an adventure. Hi, my name is Christopher Brown and I'm a student at USF St. Petersburg in the MBA program. I, I personally think that everyone in the MBA program should be required to study abroad, uh, whether their focus is international business or not. I think that one of the, the big problems with business people that I work with every day is that they have absolutely no concept of what life is like outside of the suburb that they live in. And even if you don't plan to work in international business, I think the exposure to life and business in another place where, where things are just different um, is, is useful to, to gain that perspective so that when you're making decisions in your business, whatever kind of business it may be, you can kind of, of work with a broader set of tools, you have a broader base of experience, and you're not just doing things, like they say, out of a textbook based upon what somebody else thought. You've actually seen it in real life. So I think that, that every MBA student should do this. Uh, particularly those who hope to work um, in the future in a global corporation. And uh, that's the case for, for most growing companies today, is that they do, have, they do have contacts and suppliers in other countries and customers in other countries. And so the, this international study is critical for that.